Hi everyone, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a kitchen organization slash revamp. I kind of got a change of heart recently and I want to basically just revamp everywhere in my house so or in my apartment so i'm starting in the kitchen i'm gonna go hopefully this will be a series room by room kind of just refresh things get you know a couple new pieces here and there not like completely redo everything but for the new year i just kind of want to feel like a fresh start a little bit and i also want to feel really organized this year so today we're going to do the kitchen um i got a bunch of organizers from home goods and target and i also have a bunch of cleaning products because before i go through and organize everything i want it to be super clean like pretty much spotless um i want it to feel like i just moved in here like it's brand new everything is perfectly organized it just doesn't stress me out like it does right now so i'm gonna go through first i guess with all of you the stuff that i got from target that's cleaning supplies and then towards the middle of this video once i clean everything clean out the fridge i don't know just disinfect everything disinfect the oven all that kind of stuff once i do that i will go through all of the like organization and decor pieces that i picked up so far dishwasher pods these are my favorite ones i got some mr clean magic erasers just to you know work on the walls and stuff if there's any marks got some gloves just because i ran out of these this is for the bathroom so not even necessary i finally got one of these scrub mommies i've tried the scrub daddies before but i wanted to try the scrub mommy i don't know i'm just very intrigued by it if you guys have never seen these before this is like meant to clean the spoon it's like it looks like it's just oh, a cute smiley face but it there's a meaning behind why it's a smiley face it's like supposed to help with cleaning things a lot so i got that i got more of my favorite counter cleaner disinfectant the pink grapefruit is really good also the honey crisp apple from method i really like and then the last thing i got is this clorox cleaner plus bleach and then i got a giant thing of paper towels but that's everything that i got for cleaning products i have my alani new breezeberry right here that i'm going to be drinking while i go through and clean the kitchen i'm going to like take everything out of the fridge disinfect it i don't know i just like when things are too messy i get super stressed out yeah hopefully you guys enjoy seeing me revamp and just make my place a little bit cuter and more true to me i'm gonna play a show on my tv and just get started cleaning okay
Hello everyone, it's been quite a few hours. I feel like the time lapse that I'm gonna show you of me cleaning is gonna be like a minute or two long, but I've been cleaning for like three hours. I wasn't expecting to go this hard with the cleaning, but I just felt like if I was gonna organize the inside, I needed the outside of the kitchen to be clean as well. And I'm just weird, like I just don't like bring anything new into my apartment when it's not pristine and clean because then I'm like this thing that I'm bringing in new is just gonna get dirty it's all in my head kind of because it's in reality not gonna get dirty but I just I would have like a panic attack so much better sorry if you can hear the dishwasher but I went through and I cleaned everywhere like literally inside of the oven inside of my coffee machine inside of the microwave i am most proud of right now the fridge it's funny i feel so good right now and i haven't even started organizing or decorating out here literally all i've done is just clean it but i already feel a thousand times better i cannot wait to take a shower right now and when i get out i'm gonna do a target haul and show you guys all the other new stuff that i got but right now i am most proud of the fridge because i really it was long overdue, me cleaning this completely out. And I even cleaned the freezer, which I haven't done in forever. And look at how much frozen fruit I had. I keep, I didn't know that I had all of this because it was so unorganized. So every time I went to the grocery store, I just kept buying more and more and more because I didn't know I had all of these bags. Like I have a brand new bag of strawberries. Who? would have known random things um kodiak waffles because you guys know i'm obsessed so i have a whole section for that some boca burgers it's just so much better i could barely shut this because it was so full and then up here the fridge is perfection <laughs> well as perfection as it can be it's not ever gonna be like one of those pinterest fridges because although this fridge is a big size fridge it's not like um an apartment size fridge you know the smaller ones it is bigger but it doesn't hold that much stuff actually um i feel like my smaller fridge in my last apartment held more food this is my hot sauce section because we all know your girl can never get enough hot sauce so i have a whole section for it and then we have the condiments up here i don't want to go through everything but we have beverages up at the top more beverages because I have a ton of Oxy Shred left over from a campaign that they ran. A bunch of yogurts because I have a Greek yogurt pretty much every day. We have bread. I started keeping my bread in the fridge because I just don't go through it quick enough when it's in the pantry. A ton of pre-made rice right here. Salsas, eggs. I have this little egg container, super cute. So yeah, my fridge is feeling like a really big accomplishment right now for me. I just keep opening it and looking at it because I'm like, wow, I did that. So now I'm gonna take a shower and when I get out, we will go through and start actually organizing. I have so much energy right now, it's really late, but I'm gonna keep going because I just, I feel good. Hello everyone, I am out of the shower. Hopefully the background is okay. If it looks messy, the living room is the last thing on my mind right now. I am focused on the kitchen, but right now is the fun part because I'm gonna go through and show you guys a haul of everything I got from Home Goods and Target to actually do the purpose of this video, which is to organize. I'm gonna start off with the stuff that I got from Home Goods. So this was five dollars. It's one of those tiered organizers to put in a cabinet so that way you can use more space which i really need to do um, my pantry is super deep and tall and i have like no way of storing all of my things in a productive fashion so i got those ones and then i got three of these bigger gray ones i honestly would have gotten more for all of my other cabinets but i pretty much bought out home goods of all of these little shelves because I guess everyone is trying to organize their homes. Okay, we have a big bag here from TJ Maxx. I honestly wanted to get most of my stuff from there, but I couldn't find like cute decor like I was envisioning in my head, which is why I'm not finished shopping yet. I'm pretty close. I don't really need a ton of stuff, but I just didn't get everything that I was envisioning in my head. I don't have a specific 
idea in mind. I just, I'll know it when I see it. And my kitchen's really small, so it's not like I need a ton of decor, but I do need a couple more things. I got some dish towels. These were $7.99, good price. Just plain white. I have some Valentine's Day ones that I'm gonna wash right now, but I just figured I could use some white ones as well. And then in here, let's see, I got some candles. Oh, I also got this shaker bottle because I've never seen a white one before and I thought that was cute and I use that I'll use that for like my pre-workout and stuff. I got some really good candles um, that smell really good. This one I see all the time on Instagram, this brand Candier, Candier, but it's called Love Blah Blah Wine. <laughs> That's the scent name of it. Super cute, right? And just like fun for Valentine's Day, but also pretty trendy. I was surprised to see that at Home Goods. And then the other one that I got, this other candle. My camera is flashing the battery. I'm hoping that it doesn't die before I finish this haul. Um, this candle is called Midnight Citrus by Red Leaf Home, and it smells really good. I figured I would just take the lid off, keep it open like this, and peel off the sticker. So it's just gonna be like a plain, white candle which i think is a little bit cuter and then the last couple things i got from home goods is these two clear containers i don't really know exactly what i'm going to do with these yet um but i'm sure i will find a use for them probably somewhere in my pantry okay now we're gonna go through target because i did get a lot of other things besides just the cleaning products that i showed you guys first thing i was really excited about is this little tray i have a a vision for it on the counter in the corner with a couple other things i need to get fresh flowers tomorrow with like a vase you guys will see but i got that and then to go on the tray i got these two candles just like plain white they're in the scent soft cotton they actually smell really good i don't have any intentions on actually lighting them but they do smell really good and they look cute okay i guess i really didn't get as much stuff as i thought the next thing i have is some bleach i didn't realize that was in there and then this other thing that i got this is irrelevant i got some picture hangers because this painting behind me i don't even like it anymore i've had it for so long i'm not even like obsessed with it anymore but i've been meaning to hang it above my couch for so long i finally got some stuff to hang it up with so that way it's not on the ground anymore and then i have two more things from target hopefully i can get through this before it dies i got this little spice rack organizer i have a lot of spices and hopefully this is gonna hold majority of my spices on it i'm not gonna do that whole pinterest thing where you do the labels and everything because that is just too much work okay i just i'll be honest that is too much for me but i am gonna try and put them on this because it's so annoying having them all behind each other so hopefully this will make my life a lot easier and then the very last thing that i got from target for now is this rug because i needed a new kitchen rug the one i was using was like four years old at this point they still sell it at target um the same one that i had but i figured i'd switch it up this one is like black and white it's just from the project 62 So it's kind of hard to envision this exactly how it's gonna be without the actual flowers because I think that'll really make it. But I have a vase, it's just really hot right now because it just came out of the dishwasher. That's gonna go right here and there's gonna be some colorful flowers in it, hopefully all the time. So that way it looks nice and fresh and pretty. I think it'll look really good once I get the flowers in here, which I'm gonna go get tomorrow. But in here is where I keep all of my spices. I actually just recently went through this cabinet. Sorry if it was just a little bit bright, but I believe it or not, I just recently went through this and organized everything. I'm talking like a couple of days ago and it's already looking a little bit rough, but I'm gonna focus first on the spices right here because that's pretty much all that's 
in this cabinet and I think it'll really make it look so much better. Hi guys, good morning. It is the next day. I went to bed last night around like three and I woke up this morning at eight, just excited, feeling energized, just at the thought of organizing. So I already got a little bit of a head start. I had to go to the grocery store. Well, I didn't have to, but I wanted to go to the grocery store to get some flowers. Like I told you guys yesterday, I got a pistachio latte from Starbucks. So it was a great morning. They didn't have what I wanted for florals. I wanted just like plain white red or pink roses but they didn't have any I'm assuming because they're getting ready to use all of them for Valentine's Day soon so I went for this I don't really know what any of this is but I think it looks kind of pretty and this is more so the vision that I was going for really cute so there's that and then over here I did get this little table that I was telling you guys about yesterday so this is from Target it was ten dollars I'm so sad though because I meant to get a new olive oil what are they called like pitcher you know what I'm talking about the thing that you put olive oil in I meant to get another one of those but I completely forgot so I need to get one soon because that's gonna go on top of there and look really cute and then yeah I'm gonna start tackling the pantry in a second but from Target I also got these containers that you guys just saw I organized underneath my sink nothing too crazy but it just looks so much better I went through there was a lot of stuff in there that just needed to be thrown out and it was very cluttered and overwhelming so I feel so much better now with these bins from Target. They have so many organizational things at Target for super cheap. I think these were like $7 a piece, which is really good considering somewhere like the Container Store would charge like $20 a piece for these. So I'm feeling very good already. We're getting off to a great start. So I also got four more of these containers. These ones are just a little bit smaller from Target. 
and then I'm gonna take out all the other stuff that I showed you guys yesterday in the haul and we're gonna get to organizing the pantry first. I am pretty much feeling like a brand new person. These risers that I put in the back are such a game changer. They make life so much easier because I can use so much more space in these cabinets. It's just nice because I can see almost everything in the cabinet. Before, I couldn't see anything and that's why I have multiples of so many things because I didn't know that I had it in stock in my pantry because it was hidden by like everything else and it was so cluttered so things just look so much better i put a riser on every single shelf and then on these ones i did the two black um little baskets from target and then on this bottom one with the riser i did um these two little clear bins that i got from home goods so everything is so much better so yeah this cabinet is all done and the only thing i really have left that i want to organize is these two cabinets because this is a mess as i'm sure you can see and then same with this one it's like there's mugs down here mugs up here cups down here cups up there it's like which one is which so i'm kind of embarrassed i need to go through these and just make it look a little bit better. I only have one riser left, which I guess is a good thing. I'm putting all the stuff that I bought to like good use. Um, but yeah, I only have one left. So I'm probably gonna put this one somewhere in here for now. Honestly, this looks like I have a ton of stuff, but it's just all these meal prep containers that aren't organized together. So that's gonna make a huge difference once I do that. And then up in this cabinet, you guys saw, I think I did a time-lapse of it last night. I did the spices. Everything looks pretty good. I do have actually still an overflow of spices over here, a couple up there. I just have a lot, but it's okay. It's like so much better than it was. And although this is very cluttered and it looks kind of crazy, it's much better than the system that I had going before. Up on this cabinet, this one doesn't need anything because it's super full. This is my like supplement area, so I have a ton of oxy shreds. There's a ton of protein powders back there.
total, these two cabinets took me about 15 minutes, but it makes the world of difference. I put plates down there. I organized all of the Tupperware so it looks so much better. And then blenders are way up at the top. But, you know, it's not like super aesthetically pleasing, but it's way better than it was. And then over here we have a glassware on the bottom. And then I also have these clear mugs down here just because I didn't know what to do with them. Wine glasses, regular drinking glasses, things I put my coffee in. Up here we have all of my mugs nice and organized and then at the top is random stuff like shaker bottles alcoholic shaker bottles but it looks so much better and it just feels so good so i am officially done 12 hours later with organizing and decorating my kitchen to a way that i actually truly enjoy i feel this sense of inner peace that i can't explain just from having every inch of my kitchen organized truly the best feeling in the entire world i just think it looks so much cuter and just so much more me and then on top of that i feel very inspired because things are organized so i feel like i can cook better i just feel overall better got a really big head start on the spring cleaning but now that i started i just want to go into every single room in my apartment and continue organizing so you guys have to let me know which one do you want to see next and it's not just organizing it's also redecorating like i want to redo slightly everywhere in my apartment so let me know what you want to see next we have a lot of options living room the main bedroom that i sleep in the main bathroom we have the office we have the guest bathroom so there's a bunch of options so just let me know what you guys want next out of those options and i will deliver because i'm ready to go like i feel so good already make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe here if you guys are new and also follow me over on instagram hopefully this was satisfying somewhat to watch seeing me go through everything and just make everything better i'm gonna go edit this video though so i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll talk to you in my next one very soon bye